Hey kids, welcome to Toy Pals TV, where we love to learn and play. Today we're going to be looking at this huge dinosaur collection, setting them up and having some fun, so hang on. Alright, here we go, and we're going to start with our first dinosaur. And everybody knows who this guy is. He is Stegosaurus. He's a pretty big one. We will stick him right over here. Can we see him? There we go. Next, who do we have? Uh oh, everybody's favorite. T Rex. King of the Hill. Put him up on top. Next, it is another T Rex. This one looks like he's real hungry. Tyrannosaurus Rex. King of the Dinosaurs. Who's next? Oh, he's long neck. Oh. Brachiosaurus. He is quite a big dinosaur. We'll stick him right there. And who do we have here? Ooh. An Allosaurus. Yeah, he could be an Allosaurus. We'll put him there. Oh, he's another long neck. He, maybe he's Brontosaurus from the Flintstones. Or Brachiosaurus, whichever you prefer. Oh. Another Stegosaurus. Ooh. Ooh, this guy's got good detail to him. Triceratops. Alright, now we got some smaller ones. We also have bigger ones. Who's this guy? Is he a Spinosaurus? He looks more like a little lizard. Oh, this guy looks like a Velociraptor. Alright. Look at these little guys. Remember these maybe from the last video we did, we have a lot of these little guys. But you know who he is? He looks like a Velociraptor too. Very cool. Oh, who's this guy? Oh, very realistic one, isn't he? He's an Ankylosaurus. Plated back. A club tail. He's got some good defenses. Stick him down right there. It's another T Rex. Looks like the same one. It must be his brother. Put him up there. Ooh. Another Triceratops. It's a gray. Dark gray one. Alright. Who do we have here? Ah, this is the guy I couldn't identify the last time. It's a Parasolophus. The flathead. And Parasolophus. Here he goes. He's got Play-Doh in his mouth. Get that Play-Doh out of your mouth. I believe he's a Gigantosaurus, this guy. He looks like a T-Rex, but his head's got some different types of details on it. I think it is Gigantosaurus. He looks like he'd be a good fight for the T-Rex. Stick him right in the middle there. Aha! What do we have here? It's another Parasolophus. He's uh, got a little different markings and a red head, if you notice. And many dinosaurs have different colors because we didn't really know what color they were. But it is a Parasolophus. Cool. Who is this guy? I don't know. He's got flared feathers on his head with a couple of dots. Makes it look like he's got four eyes. 
if uh, anybody can help, tell me who you think this guy is. I would appreciate it. Thanks very much. Oh, all right. And this looks like a raptor. I don't know if he's a velociraptor or a Utah raptor. But you can see with the uh, claws on his toes, he's definitely a raptor. I think he's a Utah raptor. Very cool. This guy look, pretty much looks like a T-Rex, too. He can be slightly different. These things over his eyes. But for the most part, I'm going to say this guy's a T-Rex as well. I think we saw one of these already. There's a Brachiosaurus. Another long neck. I'll say he's a Brachiosaurus as well. He kind of looks like a Brachiosaurus, but he's not. He's a Diplodocus. You can tell by the extra long tail he's got and those little spikes on, the, on his spine that go all the way down his neck, all the way down his back, and all the way down his leg. He could have actually been bigger than most Brachiosauruses. Not the Stegosaurus. I certainly wouldn't want to get hit by his tail. This is another close sibling of a T Rex. I think he is also a T-Rex, but I'm not 100% sure, but I will be by the time I edit this video. Ooh, he's got some nice markings for Triceratops, huh? Looking like a T-Rex. Mm -hmm. Oh, this guy's a Spinosaurus, but he's a squishy one. Look. He's kind of cool for kids to play with because they can't get hurt. They can smash each other with them. Spinosaurus. Some people say he was more ferocious than a T-Rex. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe you can ride on top of him. The movie. This is Rudy. I don't know what name he has other than Rudy. But Rudy was a pretty popular dinosaur in Ice Age. He was really, really, really tough until a mama T-Rex pushed him off the cliff. Oh! There's another Brachiosaurus. And another long. Triceratops and a stega, another stegosaurus. We have the big granddaddy of them all. He is the big grandpa Brachiosaurus. Let's put him way in the back. Maybe you can fit him in the screen. Maybe not. I don't know. Wow. Some more guys. Look at this guy. He's pretty. Pretty nice colors on him too. Wow. Another little T-Rex type of guy. And another Triceratops. And another T-Rex. And there's another 
Interesting T-Rex. Interesting walk on him. Wait, what do we have here? Hey! It's a skeleton! Skeleton. I think this is T-Rex skeleton. Kind of cool. Put him right in there. Oh, another Spinosaurus. A toddler's toy type. And then an Ankylosaurus. Oh, look at him. Look, we got more bones. And more bones. And another kitty one. Toddler one. Maybe from Dinosaur Train or something like that. Who's this guy? He was a toy. I think he was a Happy Meal toy. He's like a robotic. So he's kind of cool. Push the button, and he makes the noise. And then we have this guy. I think he was a Happy Meal toy too. And I think maybe he was from Ice Age. But watch this. Watch his face change. Whoop. Pretty cool, huh? Here's another one. Here is two. A couple more squishy guys. Here's another squishy one. Squish his mouth together. It opens up. Squishy guy, huh? Here's another one of those squishy guys. He's kind of crazy looking. He kind of looks like a Spinosaurus of some type. Look. These guys are kind of cool because, like I said, you can throw them at people. You can't hurt them. Okay. Several hours later, I have set everyone up. And we've got just about every single dinosaur out here. So, I have a little challenge to our viewers. Within all these dinosaurs, there are two non-dinosaur animals. If you can find them and post the names of those animals in the comments, I'll give you a shout out on our next dinosaur video. So, look carefully. Very carefully. I'll give you a good look at them all. It's not easy. There's a couple lazy dinosaurs right there. Here is the entire dinosaur collection set up. You can see it from here. It's quite impressive, huh? And what happens at the end of any good dinosaur video? As you may know from the last video, there's usually some destruction involved. But look who we have here. We've got the big daddy plush. Brachiosaurus was more than happy to destroy and knock all of the dinosaurs down. Are you ready, Brachiosaurus? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, go for it. Okay. everybody there you have it remember to subscribe and like us 
put in the comments who are the two non-dinosaur animals and we will put the first person's answers, correct answers, in a shout out in our next dinosaur video. Alternate ending. Oh man, what are all these dinosaurs doing? Oh, mm. As you can see, it was a chaotic time. Alternate ending number two. Cookie Monster, that's a dinosaur. A shout out to Disney Car Toys with your uh, fabulous Cookie Monster idea. Oops. I think he likes cookies. I think so. Maybe he likes dinosaurs too. They probably taste like cookies. You're welcome, cookie. Ooh. I have a stegosaurus. I bet you that tastes horrible. Oh. That was alternative ending number two. Again, thanks for watching. Talk to you soon, kids.